After noticing how terrible my nails look, I think this is the perfect time for me to share with you all how I paint my nails. Now, before we get started, do you guys want to see these little bad boys before I tame them? Are you ready? Here you go. This has to be about six weeks of me not taking care of them. And I do have to apologize because my hands are looking like alien hands right now. And if you really think about it, a hand is really just like a really big piece of meat that somebody or something along the way decided to just cut it like this. Bloop. 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 I don't know, they're really weird, but I mean they're powerful, right? The hands are really powerful, but it's weird. And I just noticed if I keep talking about this, this video is gonna go that way, really far away, when I really need it to go this way. So we can just get started. You guys to know that I don't really own many nail products. I don't have a big collection. So if you're anything like me and you have very limited tools, then this is the perfect video for you. I will tell you the five items that I'll be using today. First one, a wooden stick. It has two different ends. The first end looks like this. It looks like it was sliced in half, to be honest. And the second end is very, very pointy. There we go. It does the job, works perfect. The second one is going to be a nail filer. Mine is not too long and it's not too thick. I think it's just perfect for me. Here we go. Right here, great. Then um, I'm going to go in and use my base coat. This is the one that I'll be using right here. To be honest, I'm not really good at always using the base coat. So for me, this is optional. It's definitely not mandatory. My nail polish, this one is a gel nail polish. I'll be using this beautiful pink color. And finally, and most importantly, I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend you to use a top coat because when you use it for me it lasts about three to four weeks and that's with me washing the dishes scrubbing the tub playing with kids there's so many things that this works it's a miracle so i highly recommend it all right i do apologize because earlier in the video i mentioned we only needed five products but if you do remember i still have nail polish in my hands so the next two products i'll be using is actually just any nail polish remover that you have at home and some cotton balls so you're just gonna see me take this off so that i can actually put on new nail polish here so let's take this off okay. So if you guys notice right now, the next thing I really, really like to do even after I take off my nail polish is I like to run my hands underneath warm water to really soften up the nail bits. So let's go. So now I take my wooden stick and I just start pushing the cuticles back. I'm really, really careful when it comes to this, just because I still don't want to get hurt. Now I am going to use my nail filer. Remember when you're using this, make sure to follow it in one direction. In short little strokes, just like this. Now the reason why I recommend for you to go in one direction is because when a lot of people do this and they go on both directions then you'll notice that this starts creasing 
and a lot of product gets stuck right there. So just one direction, one way, that's the way to go. One, two, one, two. And just do little by little to get a more accurate straight line or curve, whatever you want. Now we get to use the nail polish and I am using this beautiful pink color called Sit Me in the Front Row. How scandalous. Perfect for this kind of everything. <laughs> I don't know. I just really like this pink color so let's just get started and paint some nails. Now for this one, doo -doo -doo. you know I wanted to make my own song for this video but the person behind the camera was like, no Joanna, you shouldn't make your own song that's just a little too much for this video so someday you'll hear my wonderful lyrics that i created in my mind okay let's get started before i get murdered for doing this okay so i always get very very little product and just lightly start painting it We made it to the ending of my very first YouTube video. If you guys enjoyed spending some time with me and my hands, then I do invite you to hit the like button and subscribe to all of my future videos. I promise you that we will have a really good time. All right, have a great day and stay safe. Bye. The second one is going to be a nail filer. You might find it somewhere lingering around your home, and if you don't, you could also... The second item... Now, because I am using this... Now, because I am using my left hand, by the time I'm finished with all my nails, then it's about time to start the nail, the nail polish. There we go. I'll probably cut that out. Maybe not. You'll see in the final product. And it's ready. And by that, I mean that it's ready for the top coat. What? <laughs> and then I apply my top coat. When I'm finished with, with, 